Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport. Today is episode number 34. If you guys do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Okay, so we are here for what is hell, pretty much. This is the All-American Face-Off, um, again for the, I think this is the third time now. But uh, this time it is for uh, the championship series. Viper versus Corvette. We're taking the Hennessy Viper this time. I know last time we took the... Uh, the first time we took the Corvette. The second time we took the Lingenfelter, whatever it is. Which is the Corvette, but the supercharged version. Uh, and now we're taking the Hennessy Viper for this one. Um, starting off with the uh, Road Atlanta. Alpine Ring. Tokyo Circuit, Maple Valley, Sunset Peninsula Speedway, Silverstone, and Test Track Infield. Let's get going. All right. Let's get cracking. That is one hell of an engine noise. I think the turbo has made this car ridiculously overpowered, but it is what it is. There we go. Not bad. This was never meant for you and I. This song does in fact slap. There we go. Bum 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 There we go. That hiss noise, though, every time the throttle gets released. Innocence, yeah. Bum bum bum, bum bum bum. There's so many good songs by these guys. It's unreal. Yo, Sinsu, what up? How are you today, man? Welcome. Uh 
There we go. Those wallpapers I have, do they have other kinds other than cars? What do you mean by that? And what wallpapers? I'm confused. <laughs> oh, this car is crazy. I love it, actually. We actually might lap the Corvette in last place, which would be kind of an interesting. Uh, oh, the wallpapers that I have. Uh, they're all cars only. But yeah, if you do um, exclamation mark scapes, you should be able to find the wallpapers and download them at max quality as well. They're raw files, so. If there's some cars that you like, or if you want me to take some photos as well of cars that you like, let me know and I'll get them done. Because I'm trying to make like a huge collection of just photos of cars. Wow, GTA M's not in Gran Turismo. <laughs> They're all Gran Turismo escapes. So. <laughs> oh, but I did see a rumor, and it is a rumor, so take it with a pinch of salt. But um, there are, by the looks of it, some different uh, Alfa Romeos being added to the game at some point in the future. I hope so, and I hope it's a true rumor and not just some fake shit to stir up hype. But the screenshot that I saw had uh, Alfa Romeo on it. It was a Julia. Whether it was the new GTA M or whatever it's called. I've got no clue. But uh, it was an Alfa Romeo. And it looked good. Yeah. <laughs> If it's cap, I'm going to cap the ones doing the capping. Sounds like a plan. I give you permission to do that. Because I like I like the Alfa Romeo. I really do like it. I'm obviously not crazy about it like you are. But yeah, I do quite like the Alfa Romeo. That's a good shout. You don't really get the Alfa Romeo much in this game. We are about to lap last place. How crazy is that? There we go. Yeah, Alfa Romeo is pretty good. I'm a much bigger fan of their more modern cars than their older cars. Imagine if I picked that car to drive. I would have died. Oh, that sounds good. What the fuck are you doing, you prick? Yeah, you get your ass back. Whoa! There we go. 810. Lovely. 36 grand. Not too bad. Alright. Alpine ring. Let's go. Good start so far. Bloody hell.
Bam, bam, banana. Do you know the one that I really like? The car that I really like the look of, but don't really like the brands of other cars that much? It's the Kia Stinger. Surprisingly, I actually like the look of the Kia Stinger quite a lot. Don't know why? I just really like it. It's quite a beautiful car, actually. No, not Ikea. Kia. As in the brand that does the... Uh, uh, no. The C apostrophe D. That's Jeremy Clarkson called it. Fair enough. Oh, I fucking love this song. I don't like how close that car's getting. Reaching out for something to hold. Something at home. Not bad. Oh, I want to see what happens if I absolutely chuck it through that section. Do you know what I've realised? Is that part of the track actually is basically the corkscrew? It's pretty much just a corkscrew. What I'm looking for. Reaching out for something to hold. Let's see how. Uh, got it. An automatic Julia. Not bad. Come on, fast car. We're looking at 190 miles an hour down that road. What I'm searching for. There we go. I don't know why, but I love the appeal of automatic gearboxes that can transform into a realistic kind of gearbox. Like those gearboxes where you've got like 10, 11, 12 gears where it's just smooth and you can drive and cruise and it you don't feel the gear changes whatsoever. But you can just quite happily flap the paddle down one and you're in like race mode and you're driving. Do 
now for something to hold. They are honestly the best gearboxes ever. Go, not bad. Oh, this is a brilliant song. There we go, smooth. Bam, bam. Okay, so that answers my question. You can't go flat out there. <laughs> what sexy Porsche? Which Porsche have they added? I didn't even know they added a Porsche. Let me lose who you are. Even if you ever take that step towards us. Oh, Sinsu, did you see? Um, guess what they uh, did? What Forza have done? They uh, accidentally, for two days, had Forza Horizon 1 on sale on the Xbox Store. Which means, legally speaking, so that they don't get in trouble, they have to refund everyone the money. Because they're not allowed to sell that game because of the licenses. But they also legally cannot re force a consumer to send the game back, either. So technically speaking, everyone that's bought that game should have it for free from, legal from a legal standpoint. Which is crazy to think about. <laughs> That is crazy. All right, let's go. This is it. Wow, 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 wow. Let's hope that we don't... Honestly, those um, chicanes... The, the thing is, it's the start of the lap where that death chicane is and the end of the lap. Which is two of the worst places to put those chicanes. I just hate them. They're so narrow. And it's still too wasted. That was a neat corner there. I still can't believe this album came out seven years ago. It came out seven years ago, and they still haven't released the third album yet. And the last time they released the song was four years ago.
There we go. Storming our way through the tunnels. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. I'm a seagull. Go fuck yourself. Da na 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 That's honestly the best meme ever. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. I'm a seagull. Go fuck yourself. Da na 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 na. There we go. <laughs> Shattered. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to get on with endurance races today. Squeeze through there. Just about. You got me so high. This looks like it's going to be like a nine and a half minute total time. And so far, fingers crossed, not crashed yet. It's not a crash. It's a scrape. <laughs> There's a difference. Still a scrape. <laughs> I was reading chat then, so I have excuses. I'm going to pull every excuse out of the book. We go. Not bad. Let's get this lap done. And then the next one. And then we're done with this race.
not bad. Go. Slowing down for the hairpin corner. You found out. I've got a crush on you. Watch you. You found out. I've got a crush on you. What even is this class at? This is like dubstep, drumstep. I don't even know what this song is classed as. Yeah, I completely cocked that corner up. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I've got enough of a lead anyways. I've got enough of a lead. I can do this. Bonk. There you go. Result. Got 27 grand out of that. Not bad. Four more races. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out. Yeah.